Hi, I'm John Gann, Director of Software Development at Chesapeake Technology. If you're a SonarWiz user, you probably know that processing side scan backscatter is easy and fast in SonarWiz. I'd like, though, to tell you about a new kind of bathymetry backscatter processing now available in SonarWiz. Side scan sonars provide range and amplitude for each sample in a ping. We know the location of the first sample in a ping, but we're forced to assume a flat seafloor to estimate the locations of each sample on either side of nadir. In comparison, bathymetric sonars provide range, amplitude, and angle for each sample in a ping. The additional angle value makes it possible to compute the x, y, and z of each sample of a ping. The ability of bathymetric sonars to accurately position each pixel on the seafloor adds to the clarity of a mosaic. This pixel positioning accuracy is the biggest difference between side scan sonar and bathymetric sonar mosaics. In this SonarWiz project, we can see a fairly detailed mosaic of the seafloor depicting areas of lower and higher reflectivity. The dark areas are probably softer sediments, whereas the brighter areas are probably pack sand or more reflective materials. The 600 kHz side scan record was acquired with SonarWiz using an EdgeTech 6205 sonar, which collects dual frequency side scan and bathymetry. Underneath the side scan layer, I've loaded the process backscatter from the bathymetry data. Let's zoom in to compare the data in more detail. In the bronze colored side scan layer, we can see the boundary between the lighter and darker sediments. But because of the uncertainty of the side scan pixel positioning, these areas are not well defined. If we now use the SonarWiz swipe tool to peel back the side scan and look at the bathymetry backscatter in the same location, we can see clearly defined pockets of lighter and darker sediment in much sharper detail. Again, this is due to more accurate positioning with the bathymetric sonar. If you're curious, please try the free download from our website. Thanks so much for watching this video. If you'd like to learn more, follow our YouTube channel to see more feature spotlights like this one. Join our next training session in Galway, Ireland this September. You can learn more about that session at chesapeaketech.com or leave a comment below and we'll reach out.